Hey guys, Tyler here from GarageWarrior.com and right now I want to talk to you about how to get the perfect front rack position with a barbell for things like the front squat or the cleans or any of those exercises. So one of the most important things that people neglect when doing a good front rack position is their wrist mobility. So you can test your wrist mobility rather easily by lifting your arm up and seeing if you can bring your fingers back to your front deltoid, the meat muscle right there. I don't want you to put it on your collarbones, you want it to sit on that meaty muscle right there. If you can't touch your fingers back like this, you might want to consider doing some wrist stretches where you're trying to really pull those fingers and wrists back in that same position while your upper arm stays parallel to the ground. Your wrist mobility is more often the problem with not getting a good front squat position than any other issue I see. So work on that wrist mobility simply by stretching your wrist in the same position. Now from there, when I unrack the barbell, I pick a spot that I always unrack it from. So for me, my index fingers go on this first line. What I do is I come all the way to my chest, right below my collar bones, and I come up and around with my elbows, and I'm flexing the front of my deltoids by lifting, almost like I was doing a front raise with a pair of dumbbells. So fingers on, collarbone, or right below the collarbones to there, and I come all the way around, flex the shoulders, and come up like this. And you also notice how, I'll turn to the side position right there, I barely have my fingers on the bar. That's all you need. You do not need to have full wrist position on the bar because then you're gonna put a lot more pressure on your shoulders or you could be placing it on the wrong spot along your collarbones and bruising or scraping up your collarbones. So it's really all about just having just that fingertips worth the pressure and the support coming from your shoulders and your upper arms, not from your actual wrists. And then from there, when you go through the full range of the squat, you never want to let your elbows drop down in the front squat because that signifies the fact that you don't have the thoracic spine or shoulder mobility to keep your elbows high as you go through that front squat. So ways to work on this are to have somebody push up on your elbows the whole time you do the front squat. Make sure that you have that full extension there. And also to visualize that when you front squat, there's a pair of bungee cords attached to the ceiling from your elbows. So as you unrack the bar and you go down, something's pulling up on your elbows the whole time. And when you stand up, let those things lead you up from the elbows. Let those visualized magical bungee cords lead you up from the bottom of the squat with those elbows. So that is how you guys can get your perfect front squat and a couple problems you might be having with your front squat. If you dig this video, click the like button right there. Help me spread the warrior message. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions about the front rack position with the barbell. Otherwise, you can go to garagewarrior.com for some more awesome free tips, free videos on how to work out at home and how to live the warrior lifestyle. Thanks for watching.